Warsaw, the vibrant capital of Poland, blends a rich history with modern energy from its meticulously reconstructed old town to its modern skyscrapers. The city offers a captivating mix of architectural styles. Warsaw is a city full of attractions. You will find the atmospheric old town, magnificent royal palaces, museums that tell the history of Warsaw and Poland, and the bustling boulevards on the Vistula. Discover the capital's biggest attractions. Number 10. Warsaw Barbican The Warsaw Barbican, a historic fortress originally constructed in the 16th century, stands as a symbol of the city's resilience and rich cultural heritage. This remarkable structure, with its distinctive red brick walls and turrets, once served as part of the defensive fortifications surrounding Warsaw's old town. Today, it serves as a popular tourist attraction offering visitors a glimpse into the city's past. From exploring the ramparts and towers to learning about the Barbican's role in Warsaw's history, visitors can immerse themselves in the captivating atmosphere of this iconic landmark. Whether admiring its architectural beauty or simply taking a leisurely stroll along its ancient walls, the Warsaw Barbican offers a unique and unforgettable experience for visitors to the Polish capital. Number 9. Krakowski Przemysł. Connecting the historic old town with Wilno Palace, Krakowski forms part of the northern section of the famous Royal Route. It is renowned for its regal history and incredible architecture, including a parade of aristocratic residences, palaces, churches, and elegant townhouses that exude a timeless charm. For centuries, this grand boulevard has been a focal point of Warsaw's cultural and social life, and you get a real sense of this as you traverse the street. Notable landmarks like the Presidential Palace, the University of Warsaw and St. Anne's Church can all be easily visited. Don't be surprised if you spend a lot of quality sightseeing time here. Number 8. Chopin Museum It is worth checking out the Chopin Museum if you are a fan of classical music. This brilliantly thought out and well-maintained museum takes you on a captivating journey through the life and works of this genius composer. It is housed in the Ostrogsky Palace and opened its doors in 2010 after an extensive renovation. The museum features interactive exhibits that provide an immersive experience to visitors. They allow them to explore Chopin's world through multimedia displays, original manuscripts, and even his personal belongings, showcasing the composer's life from childhood to his international acclaim. The museum offers a profound insight into his creative process and the cultural context of his time. Thanks to innovative audio-visual installations and touch-sensitive screens, you should get a really good understanding of the man and his music. Number 7. Palace of Culture and Science Dominating the skyline in Warsaw is the Palace of Culture and Science, which just happens to be the second tallest building in the country. Completed in 1955, the structure was designed by Soviet architect Lev Rudnov, who blended various architectural styles, including socialist realism. Its design was inspired by the high-rise Art Deco buildings of America and historical Polish architecture. It was previously known as Joseph Stalin's Palace. However, this name was later dropped during the time of destalinization. Today, 
It houses various cultural institutions, theaters, museums and conference halls which you can visit. Tourists can also ascend to its panoramic terrace to enjoy breathtaking views of Warsaw. Number 6. Warsaw Uprising Museum The Warsaw Uprising Museum stands as a poignant memorial to one of the most significant events in Polish history. The museum commemorates the heroic uprising of the Polish people against Nazi occupation during World War II. Through immersive exhibits and personal testimonies, the museum chronicles the story of the Warsaw Uprising, honoring the courage and sacrifice of those who fought for freedom. Visitors can explore the underground bunkers, witness first-hand accounts, and gain a deeper understanding of the wartime struggle for independence. The Warsaw Uprising Museum serves as a powerful reminder of the resilience of the human spirit and the enduring quest for liberty and justice. Number 5. Poland Museum One of the most fascinating attractions in Warsaw is the Poland Museum of the History of Polish Jews. Located on the site of the former Warsaw Ghetto, the institution is the first and only one of its kind in the country. It focuses on honoring the memory of the community created by Jews in Poland. It opened in 2013 and is notable for its unique design, which resembles an open book that symbolizes a dialogue between past and present. Once inside the museum, you'll find immersive exhibitions that trace the history of Polish Jews from medieval times to the present day. They highlight the contributions, struggles and cultural richness these people brought. Overall, the multimedia displays, artifacts and interactive installations provide a comprehensive and emotionally evocative experience for the visitor. The museum also hosts cultural events, lectures, and workshops regularly throughout the year. Number 4. Willano Palace Nestled in the Willano district of Warsaw resides one of the country's most significant historical buildings, Willano Palace, commissioned by King John III Sobieski in the late 17th century. The palace served as a royal residence and embodied the splendor of Poland's golden age. It is beautifully set among stunning gardens and parks, replete with fountains and manicured lawns that are an attraction in themselves. What makes Willano Palace immediately stand out is its seamless blend of Baroque, Rococo, and neoclassical architectural styles. You'll want to snap plenty of photos from different angles to capture its true beauty. Once inside, you'll see an impressive collection of art, furnishings and period artifacts that offer a glimpse into the opulent lifestyle of Polish royalty. Number 3. Royal Castle Perched atop Castle Square in the heart of the Old Town is Warsaw's famous Royal Castle. Originally built in the 14th century, it stands as a symbol of Poland's regal heritage and resilience. Over the years it has witnessed centuries of Polish history, 
serving as the residence of monarchs and as a political center. Unfortunately, it was severely damaged during World War II. However, it has been meticulously restored to its former glory. Thanks to reconstruction efforts, tourists can explore opulent chambers like the Great Apartment and the Throne Room, which are adorned with period furnishings and artwork. They can also enjoy the castle's impressive collection of paintings, sculptures and royal memorabilia that relate the story of the city's cultural legacy. Number 2. Lazienki Park Warsaw doesn't just have splendid architecture, it also accommodates beautiful green space too. One of the finest examples is Lazienki Park, which resides in the downtown district. It is the largest park in the city and is celebrated for its scenic beauty and cultural significance. It was originally designed in the 17th century and later transformed into a summer residence for King August Poniatowski. The park encompasses the neoclassical palace on the isle, a picturesque amphitheater, and charming pavilions scattered amidst lush landscapes. It also hosts outdoor concerts, cultural events, and the annual Chopin concerts which take place at the foot of the monument which resides within it. Number 1. Old Town Market Square For most visitors to Warsaw, the Old Town Market Square is somewhere they will spend quite a bit of time. This remarkable square bristles with charm, historical and cultural significance. Originally, it was constructed in the 13th century, but much of the city was destroyed during World War II. However, the area has been so well restored it's almost impossible to tell it was previously damaged. The square is surrounded by colorful townhouses and boasts a lively ambience with outdoor cafes, restaurants, and various street performers. It also features the imposing Warsaw Mermaid statue and is home to landmarks like the Adam Mikovich Museum and the Historical Museum of Warsaw. While the square is buzzy all day, it is worth heading down there in the evening, as that is when things really liven up. <laughs> 